1948 National Assistance Act was the key piece of legislation about social care services until the 2014 Care Act, which replaced it. So it stood in law for decades, and I think what we're seeing with the Care Act from 2014 is that actually it's already starting to fragment that the commitments that appear to be made in that act about making provision for people around a better social care settlement really haven't been fulfilled and so we're now looking at a new green paper and then potentially further legislation. So we need to be thinking about how do we make a settlement for social care that will last in a way that the National Assistance Act lasted so that we don't keep revisiting these things um, you know, every few years and failing to really make a progress on some of the key issues. Integration. We need to bring health and social care systems together rather than think about them separately as happened 70 years ago. Dignity. We need a health and social care system which is about dignity and shared citizenship rather than about exclusion and stigmatisation. Frontline. Health and social care services only work if there's a real commitment to getting resources and skills to the people at the front line who are supporting people around those services. Making it last. We need a commitment to a settlement for health and social care which can last for a generation rather than needing to be redone every few years.